The following short video will present to you the behavior of open pipes and pressure vessels and is an example. So consider this long open pipe over here and it's o since it's open in the previous vi videos we mentioned that it's only subjected to hoop stresses whereas a closed vessel has longitudinal stresses and hoop stresses. So in this case we're only looking at hoop stresses as shown in this diagram which cause radial stresses outside on the circumference. So we've got a large pipe of a diameter of 2 meters and has a design pressure of 600 kilopascals. So the question is, what minimum thickness of the pipe will ensure that the hoop stresses are no more than 50 megapascals? So we need to find the certain thickness that ensures we don't be exceed 50 megapascals worth of hoop stresses. So as we've seen this equation before, F theta, which is known as hoop stresses, equals PR divided by thickness where P is the pressure, R is the radius and T is the thickness so if we rearrange this equation we'll find that T equals to PR on F theta okay so substituting everything in uh, and we convert 600 kilopascals into megapascals so this becomes 0 0.6 megapascals okay so we do 0 0.6 times 1000 where 1000 is radius of the pipe, which I forgot to mention, excuse me. Oh no, I mentioned that the diameter is 2 meters, therefore the radius is 1 meter, which is 1000 millimeters. So it's 0 0.6 times 1000 divided by 50.